In this video, I'd like us to look at Math AI Voices versus Descript Storyboard Overlab Stock Voices. Uh, welcome to this video. Uh, my name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Basically, what I want us to do is probably say what I think uh, works best uh, for different scenarios. So, for example, uh, we've got Math here and this is Descript. So, I can just play this particular project. It has Descript Overdub Voices. Uh, it's called Project Math Voices because initially I did it with uh, Math Voices, but let's listen. Hello and welcome to our channel. Today we're talking about the best places to visit in Kenya. Kenya is a beautiful country located in East Africa, known for its spinning landscapes. Uh, feels legit. Now the good thing with Dawn is that you can change Dawn to different uh, kind of modes or moods. Angry, angry too, calm, calm too, disgusted, disgusted too, happy, happy too. I'm not sure you can do the same for Ethan. I don't think so. Uh, this formal one formal two formal three formal four so that's really really awesome nancy has casual one casual two casual three so that's really awesome to have different states uh that you can change uh in the scripts of an app that's also available in uh, math uh, but not for all voices uh, so for example what we have here is a uh, clint but let's say we go to ken and then you'll see new options here conversational promo, angry, sad, different kind of things that uh, would really uh, change a lot of things right here. Uh, but let's say we go back to Clint, I believe, yes. I think I I love Clint's voice, it's really awesome. And then we can click on generate uh, the audio uh, so that we can listen to that particular segment uh, like what we had uh, in the previous uh, scenario where we listen to a uh, discrete over that voice, that is Dawn and Ethan. Hello, and welcome to our channel. Today, we're talking about the best places to visit in Kenya. Kenya is... So, it has uh, things called poses. You can add a pose, uh, and in the script, you can add a gap clip or kind of just move this section slightly. So, you can add a gap clip so that uh, when uh, this section ends... In Kenya. Kenya is a beautiful... We have kind of like a pose of sorts uh, using the gap clips. They're kind of similar uh, but different, uh, but kind of more defined in math AI voices. So you can add a pose, uh, you can add the speed, change the pitch, and this is where uh, math AI voices uh, will shine because of the pitch, speed, and also we have things like, for example, let's say we want to change the uh, pronunciation, you can just select and you'll see this pronunciation come up, you can click on that and then you will give, be given a couple of options that you can listen to and then you can update that, let's play Kenya. so that really is not Kenya but the default one is okay you can always create custom ATC this is lacking in uh, descripts over the voices uh, but I believe it's something that they can do uh, more or less, if I put it this way, Descript's uh, storyboard is more focused on uh, audio and video editing. Uh, but I believe math voices, especially for people who want to create and repurpose projects fast, uh, they should pay some attention to the overdub stock voices and kind of borrow from what math are doing and any other uh, player in this field. Another area that math AI voices is winning is in the array of voices available from different languages 20 plus languages and we actually have english kids this is missing in the script uh, storyboard but i wish it was available uh, but yeah you can see a couple of uh, voices right here for different languages and also when you look at this you can see that multiple languages are catered for uh, so if you have projects in different languages you can use this really really awesome uh, to do but simply put, that's a math AI voice versus Descript. We see math has a ton of options for you to choose from. You can always test it out and try it out from the link below in the description. Uh, Overdub has its use, really, really awesome. Uh, but uh, the voices available, for example, if you go to the stock voices, uh, just kind of limited. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine voices. Uh, while if we go to the AI voices right inside here, 120 plus voices and in 20 plus languages, really a night and day kind of scenario here. 
uh, and also the different options available like changing the pitch the speed and adding the pose uh, and then what can you do the pronunciations uh, it's really awesome uh, I wish maybe Descript along the road can pay some attention to that especially for creators who want to create faceless YouTube videos that would really help but that's it I think Murph is a clear winner for most of the scenarios Descript will also be a winner for voices like Don uh, but hey that's it from me I hope this video is of value to you. Thanks for watching.